people say I don't belong here How the hell she get her own tear? In my heart, y'all put no fear Fuck you niggas just to be clear I'm tired of all of y'all fake misses Acting like you really fuck with me So you skimming really want my spot You call me bully, but I know you not What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Chanel, and we're here with another reaction video So we got Pure Comedy Donald Trump had had interviewer trying to hold back from laughing when speaking on his abuse case about Carol. She had a cat named Vagina. This is crazy. Y'all excuse my allergies. I know I sound crazy, but it's me in spring fight right now. Sorry, it's alright. One thing about Donald Trump though, y'all, I know this man will say anything. Like, he is a funny man. I will give this man that. He does not mind holding shit back. And I like that type of honesty. For real. I'll take that than a secretive, sneaky person any day. At least you know what you got with Trump. Alright, y'all. Let's 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 see him. So he was a newscaster, a very nice man. She called him an ape. Happens to be Afri African American. Called him an ape. The judge wouldn't allow us to put that in. Her dog or her cat was named Vagina. The judge wasn't allowed to put that in. All of those what? Things he would, but with her, they can put in anything. Access this Hollywood is a jury of anything. nine people who found right. you liable of sexual abuse. Do you think that, that that will deter women from voting for you? No, I don't think so, because I think the whole thing... What? Just so you understand. Ready? I never met this woman. I never <laughs> saw this woman. This woman what? said I met her at the front door. Trump said, I'm not guilty. Where more do you want? I don't know this lady. I don't know her. I never met her. I don't know why she is coming for me. Okay? And and, and, and they convicted me. Look, I don't know. I burnt off good rooms. I rarely go into other than for a couple of charities. I met her in the front door. She was about 60 years old. Though. This is like 22, 23 years ago. I met her in the front Damn, door. she was old. Goodman. I was immediately attracted to her, and she was immediately attracted to me. Okay. And we <laughs> had this great chemistry. We're walking into a crowded department, so... Okay, so yeah, we met. It was, it was, it was, what's up on first sight? You know, I saw her. I thought she was cute. She saw me. She thought I was cute, so we kind of, like, hit it off. You know, I don't know where things went wrong. Okay, okay. We had this great chemistry, and a few minutes later, we end up in a, a room, a dressing room. Uh-huh. Oh, y'all end up in there. That's what happened, Trump. Y'all was feeling each other, and y'all just ended up in the room, huh? Just, just, oops, you in here, too? I'm in here, too. What we doing? Right near the cash register. And then she found out there were locks in the door. So she said, I found one that was open. She found one. She learned this at trial. She found one that was open. What kind of a woman meets somebody and brings him up and within minutes you're playing hanky panky in the dressing room, okay? Oh <laughs> look, see, this is this is why I would say Trump is going to say what he's gonna say. I feel it. I'm the same way. He's like, look, we hit it off. We hit it off so good that you know we did you know, she was flirting with me. She was flirting with me. I need y'all to understand this. I don't know if she was married then or not. John Johnson, I feel sorry for you, John Johnson. <laughs> <laughs> he called her a floozy. <laughs> that's, how, that's how our grandparents and great-grandparents used to say, you know, she was a floozy. That's what he wanted to say. She was a floozy. I don't even know if she was mad or not. Hey, to be honest, in that situation, it really didn't matter because she was coming off like she wanted to See what was up with, with Mr. Trump. So, and then it turned into an uh, abuse that I don't know what happened. And you know what, y'all? There's so many women that do this. <clears throat> and it's sad. I am so sorry that this happened to men out there. To all your men out there who's been falsely accused of some stuff, I am so sorry. I can't even speak for these women, you know. I can't speak for him. But to us ladies, to us women who was not on that tight time, we are so sorry. But it's happening to y'all. And I think this is, you know, it's not even wild that it happened to Trump because it happens so much to men. It happens so much now. Let me just, if I could, 
because you asked the question. That's what Just so you understand, though. if I was walking in at the because I was very famous then, and I owned the Plaza Hotel right next door, and I owned buildings around it, I'm not going into a dressing room of a crowd at the department store. Then I say, if she was being raped, and by the way, they said she wasn't raped. Okay, that was her charge. It was, they found they did, they found, her. No, no, what? Say what? They, they, did, they said he didn't rape her. And didn't I didn't do anything else either. You know what? Because I have no idea who the hell she is. <laughs> 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 Can I ask you about her recounting? <laughs> That is funny. That is funny. And a bit conf and man, look. They've been trying to get Trump for a minute. <laughs> They've been got trying to get Trump for a minute. I don't I don't think honestly, I don't think Trump got to rape anybody. It's it's Trump. I mean, it's 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 women out there who go out there and throw themselves at men like him all the time. So I don't think he got to rip anybody. That was pretty funny. <laughs> but y'all, that concludes this video. If you haven't already, go hit that like and subscribe. Follow me on all social media platforms. That is Shoot Out Chanel. And until we meet again, we are.